Hi everyone, it's Jackie. So I have this huge big Black Friday Madness haul for you guys with some tips on what to buy for your family and stuff. So if you are interested in seeing all the Black Friday deals and specials and stuff, um, keep on watching. Okay, so I have to be really, really fast with this video because I know it's going to be a million hours long. So let's get started. I went to the mall with my sister Caitlin, who's 15 years old, and we went shopping for my five-year-old sister, which is the one you always see running around. So I went to the Disney store and they were having 20% off the entire store. So I picked up um, this cute winter coat for her. Looks like this. Has Disney princess on it. Has three little buttons right there and then the rest just zips up and little cute crown detailing on the back and I think she's really gonna like it. Okay, and my sister Caitlin, she bought Brookie this bolt stuffed animal. Also this cute little nightgown. Looks like this. It's long sleeve and it's a long dress style and then has a picture of the Disney princess in the corner right there. That's what we bought for my little sister. So next I went into Bath and Body Works and I picked up some candles because the candles were 50% off. So I bought four candles for my mom and I got Winter Candy Apple and it looks like that. This one smells really good. I bought her cinnamon sticks which I don't really like the smell of cinnamon too much but I know my mom does so I bought that for her. And then I got two candles based off of Ingrid aka Miss Glamorazzi here on YouTube. Then I bought leaves which actually smells really, really good. I think those three are, I'm going to give to my mom. And this one is for me, because I know my mom won't like this, but it's Frosted Cupcake, and it just smells like the sweetest, yummiest goodness ever. It's so yummy. And for an extra $20 at Bath & Body Works, we got this huge tote bag. Looks like this. And it is full of goodies, and the first goodie here is a little hand sanitizer that clips onto your bag. The inside interior looks like this, which is really cute and stylish. But here's what comes inside. Just a bunch of goodies for you, and this is a $150 value. This is a really good deal, and these are all full-size products and stuff, so that's awesome. So I'm giving this to my mom. Okay, and next we went. I went to JCPenney um, to pick up some stuff for my dad, and my dad is actually the hardest person in the world to shop for because I really don't know what he likes, but... Um, this is really silly and stupid, but I bought this for him since he gets really stressed from work. Um, it's called Whammit, the anti-stress, um, what's that say? The anti-stress disease, and it looks like that you, I think it's a little punching bag that you just punch when you're angry. He's just going to have a good laugh at, so Whammit. Okay, and then I also picked him up two ties because he does have to dress up in a business suit from time to time. So I got him two ties and the brand is called Izod. They look like this. I don't know if I did a good job picking them out or anything. They were buy one get one half off. So And then at JCPenney they were giving out these little cute boxes. They have these little snow globes. These Mickey Mouse snow globes. How cute is that? And then next we went to Macy's and my sister Caitlin was the one who bought this. Um, it's for my dad. She bought the Obsession Cologne because that's my dad's favorite cologne. We're actually trying to convince him that they don't make this anymore because it's such an old cologne. I think he was using this, this like when he was in high school. It came with some free goodies that we're also going to give to him. And it came with a digital picture frame. That's going to be really cool. And then it came with this huge bag. It's a Calvin Klein duffel bag. Ugh. You can't really tell what it looks like, but it's really huge. Okay, next we went to Sephora. And if you buy, like, spend, like, $25, you get a free little tote bag. I bought this. Okay, this is kind of for my sister and kind of for me. This is from Tokidoki. It's the quad. I don't know what it looks like because I haven't opened it. But there's a little keychain uh, little guy in there. Can you see him? He's right there. She really, really wanted it, but she doesn't really care about the makeup, but she really wanted the keychain, so I got this for her, and I'm going to give her the little keychain. I know that's silly, but this is the tote bag that it came with. It's pretty cute. It looks like the Sephora bag. It's plastic. Sephora right there, and then on the back it has, like, Sephora symbol right there. My sister picked up some stuff for my mom. My mom is really into painting her nails and doing cute little things with her nails, so she got 
this Sephora by OPI little set. Of okay, it comes with Run With It, Metro Chic, and then he said, and Brunette on the Internet. <laughs> These just look like colors that my mom would really enjoy. And then also picked up this little guy. I think it's lip gloss. I don't know. This is just a little, like, stocking stuffer. Okay, I already know what it is, so let's show you guys anyways. But my sister bought this for me, and it is the Smashbox Wish for the Perfect Pout lip gloss set. But I told her I wanted this, so she bought it for me, and um, it's my Christmas gift. So, <laughs> yay! They think This is what you get on your birthday. I think it stays the same, like, all the time, but it's my sister's birthday next week, so she got this. And she doesn't like makeup, so she's probably going to give it to my mom for Christmas also. Who knows? And then my sister also got a bag. And then I decided to be a little selfish and I bought myself some stuff, so. So I went to Victoria's Secret. I got these workout spandex shorts that look like this. And they look really, really short, but they're actually pretty long. Like when you try them on, they're actually longer than they look. And then I got some yoga pants, or I got one yoga pants. They look like this white. These are the crop style and they come below my knee. And then on the back, it says I heart pink and they're little gems or rhinestones and that's really cute so I bought that and I picked up this little tiny guy, this perfume. It's the pink fragrance spray. If you spend like $60 or more, you get this really really cute tote bag and if you look closely these are like little rhinestone gems. Oh my gosh how freaking adorable is that and it's huge, it's really big. I might use this for school or something. But it's so pretty. And then inside, it came with some goodies. It came with the Dream Angel Heavenly Fragrance Mist. And then the Love Spell Body Lotion. And then a Beauty Rush Lip Gloss. Me and my boyfriend went into Chic. And I told my boyfriend not to. But he bought me two pairs of shoes from Chic. And it was buy one get one half off. He bought me these little booties. And they're so cute. They have a little baby heel. And they're just so cute. They have a zipper on the side and they're very loose around the top so you can like fit like your foot in with some pants or some socks. Also he bought me these cute little shoes. They're just so freaking cute. He bought me these and they're just so darn adorable. They're so cute. I love them. So let me just tell you a quick story. My boyfriend is obsessed with Tom shoes. I'm sure you've heard of them. If you buy one, one gets sent to like a child in need which is really really sweet I really like that but I think the Tom shoes in general are so ugly I don't know why my boyfriend likes them then I came across these and they are glittery sparkly Toms and I know I don't like Toms but these were so freaking adorable I just couldn't help myself I had to get them. My boyfriend's happy because I joined the Tom bandwagon. Okay, then for my best friend, she loves perfumes, but I don't know which one she wants. So at Sephora, they have a little perfume set with a bunch of mini perfumes, um, all different kinds. So I'm going to pick that up for her and give that to her. But I also got her this because she's been kind of eyeing it for the past couple months. But this is from Icing, and it is a little jewelry stand. Looks like this. It looks kind of like the Eiffel Tower. It says Paris at the top. And I think this is going to be really good because, like, you can throw your stuff on here or kind of hang it in the little slots. Just one quick shirt from Windsor, real quick. But I got this shirt from Windsor, and it's just a purple, like, ruffly sort of shirt. And then it has, um, it's a racer back, and it has lace detailing. And it's just super, super cute, and I love it, and I can't wait to wear it. Okay, last, I went to Forever 21, and I kind of got a bunch of random stuff. Or I went to Forever 21 back in September, and I tried on this really, really cute shirt, and I fell in love with it. It's really not that much of a special shirt, but, like, I fell in love with it, like, the way it fit on me and everything. But then I put it down for a second, walked away, and when I came back, it was gone, and they didn't have any more of that shirt and I was so mad so I went online tried to look for it it wasn't online and it wasn't in any other stores so I just lost hope and I was sad but I went to Forever 21 and it was in stores wow I'm so excited you guys are gonna think this is stupid because it's not that big of a deal kind of shirt but it looks like this it's just a striped shirt three-quarter sleeve 
And on the shoulder, it has three little stud things, whatever you want to call these, that are gold. Okay, I know this shirt isn't any big deal, but, like, I fell in love with it and the way it fit me. And I just was in love with it, and I'm so glad I was able to find it. I saw every single girl in line with this shirt also. I think this is going to be a really popular shirt that everyone's going to be buying. Recently, Forever 21 came out with a Minnie Mouse collection, and I fell in love. I thought it was the cutest thing ever. I saw it online. I picked out this shirt, or no, this dress, or this tunic, whatever it's called. It's, it has pink, uh, like a dull pink um, sequence kind of thing, like all over. And then in the bottom corner, it has a sequin Mickey Mouse head. And it is just so freaking adorable. Like, I'm in love with this. I can't wait to wear it. It's so cute. And then, also from the Minnie Mouse collection, I picked up this notebook. It says Minnie Mouse off to the runway. How cute is that? And it opens this way, like that. Um, I bought this for my sister, and I think she's really going to like this. She likes notebooks and stuff like that. This is from the same collection, and this is for my sister. I bought this awesome hoodie jacket, looks like that, and it just has, you know, all this, like, Japanese or Chinese, kind of Asian handwriting all over. We're part Japanese, and she just really embraces that. She loves everything about that, so I think I might give this to her birthday, because her birthday's next week, so I bought that for her. She's going to love it. She actually does love it, because she tried it on, and she loved it, and then also I got, um, these dark washed skinny jeans from Forever 21, these were on sale for $7. I'm like, I can't get any better than that, you know? This is for my mom, but how cute is that? Can you see? It comes with two flowers and then a butterfly. They're just so cute. Okay, and then if you buy like $30 of stuff, you get like a free gift from Forever 21. I got a gold locket like this. And I got the gold one and the silver one. I don't know where the silver one went because I, I was wearing it today and I took it off. But it's really cute. It's just a long um, heart locket with lip gloss inside the locket. How freaking cute is that? So I know that my family and my boyfriend, they don't watch my videos. They all know about my videos, but they don't really watch it because everything I say in my videos, I tell them in real life so they don't care to see it in videos. You know what I mean? So I know they're not going to watch it, so I know they won't find out what I'm going to get them. So I told you when I got my parents and my younger sister for Christmas. So gives you kind of a little idea um, of maybe you're stuck and you don't know what to get. For my boyfriend, um, as you can tell, I didn't buy anything for him. That's because he was with me the whole time. But for my boyfriend, I'm actually getting him a jersey of from Real Madrid, their new jersey. I get him that like every single year. But they always come out with a newer jersey, so I always get it for him because he loves Real Madrid. That's a team in Spain, by the way, in case anyone was wondering. But that's his favorite team, so I'm going to get him the jersey. And also a little, um, I'm getting him something else, but if I say it, people are going to think it's weird. You know what, whatever. I'm just going to say it anyways. I'm getting him a tattoo. <laughs> that's silly, huh? But my boyfriend is really into tattoos. He doesn't have any yet, but he's really into tattoos and eventually wants like a whole sleeve, which I don't mind, actually. Like, I personally wouldn't do that. Like, I would probably never get a tattoo, but um, he's really into it, and I I approve. So I wanted to take him to get his first tattoo. He kind of already knows about it, and I know what he wants, so it's kind of okay for me to just surprise him with, I'm getting you a tattoo. But he wants his last name right here on his forearm in some sort of weird letters, maybe like Hebrew or something. Something where, like, people can't, like... They don't know what it says sort of thing. He thinks that's really cool, and I think it's kind of cool, too. That's weird, huh? Is that weird? I know that's a weird gift, but I know he's really, really going to like it and really going to appreciate it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I hope it was somewhat helpful. Probably not, but if you have any questions, go ahead and leave them below, and I will be sure to answer them. If you notice, I really try to comment every single person back. So, yeah, just go ahead and comment below, and I will get back to you. Then, yeah, I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye!